What's up guys, it's Brian again from Lake Hickory Scuba and Marina and we're headed up to do another pool repair. Uh, this is gonna be a minor repair, it's just got a small little hole in the liner. Uh, the homeowner gave us a call yesterday, said that he found the hole, wants us to come out and patch it. Uh, what we're actually going to do today, depending on how big the hole is, we're probably going to double patch it, meaning I'm going to put a patch over the hole and then I'm going to put a larger patch over that one. And I wouldn't typically do that, but the reason I'm doing it on this one is simply because the area of where the hole is, um, it gets a lot of foot traffic. It's right at the the deepest part of the ramp, if you will, going into the deep end of the pool. So it's going to be getting a lot of foot traffic, so I want to give it a little extra protection. But we'll cut a patch to fit seal it over and then I'm gonna cut a larger patch seal over top of that and anytime that you do this guys you want to make sure that your patches are round you don't want any sharp corners because that just gives it something to grab onto if somebody does happen to uh, step on or something just grab and rip that patch right off so come along with us over and we'll see how good we do Where'd you go? There you are. Give me my knife. I'm gonna give. I'm gonna give you. <laughs> Big enough for my thumb to here, maybe an inch on each side. Okay. Yep. Just to do the three by three, we got plenty. Yeah, hand me that brush. It, there should be a little brush there. It ain't worth much, but it'll work. That's fine. Anything bigger than about a baseball, I tell people to. It's very difficult to do big, big holes. part about this one, people's feet's going to be all over it. Here we go.
Now cut me one twice as big, but don't put corners on it. Round it off and go over the top of that one. So guys, as you can see, it wasn't too difficult. We ended up putting a smaller patch over the top, and then we put a big, large, round patch over the top of that. That's going to help secure that first one, plus it's going to keep uh, any sharp edges from the patches from fraying up or anything like that. But I appreciate you coming on this dive. If you got any questions on any of our salvage work or any pool repair like this, simply put it down in the comment section below. If you like this video you want to see more like it, simply smash that like button for me. As always, guys, make sure you follow us on Instagram and Twitter. Like us on Facebook. Pin us on Pinterest. Subscribe to us here on YouTube. And as always, guys, we appreciate your business.